Hello dear viewers, it's Mivia and let's boom this episode to make it a good episode where we will talk about what you can do when you have an art block. Next, we will talk about greatest way for making shadows in digital art, in my opinion of course, which can be the most convenient one, especially if you're never sure about the colors you want to use. And then we'll become a bit more serious and I'll mention the tragedy of loneliness. And at the end, we will, I will just mention a little why I stopped working my comic book. Let's get started! So, uh, at the beginning, as always, I will mention about what's going on on the drawing. For now, it's just a draft. I made it because well, I felt anything I do is bad. So, the famous art book. And here, to be honest, don't know where it came from. It's the time when I should be the most creative, the most inspired, but I felt anything I was doing was a boo-boo. So, I decided that I will take something that I personally like to draw and instead of drawing it in the way I do usually, push myself toward doing something more out of it. Doing more detail, doing everything more. <laughs> and weirdly, it took me less time than usually. So that's how I mostly decided to fight against this art block. Art block is a really big topic and I already lived it many times in my life, I found some nice ways to deal with it and I think that's one of them, to just take something that you like to draw because if you push yourself to draw something that you don't like, of course you can draw for different reasons, maybe you want to draw to improve, but how can you draw to improve if you don't want to draw anything? Isn't it better than to just take something that you like? Even if you like drawing apples, just you would take an apple and you would draw the best apple that you ever made. And then looking at this apple you will feel, yes, I made it, I'm proud of myself, so I can do even more. I suppose it can work like that, for me it does, of course everyone is different. But maybe it could work for you if right now you are fighting against the famous enemy of the artist, which is, of course, our lovely art block. So, in this video, there's nothing much I can say about line art. I made it without trying to make it too clean. It is a little messy, but I wanted it to have kind of this spirit. Uh, still, it stays in its place, but I wanted it to be there, so the colors would be what will define this drawing, not the line art. Line art was just some lines, if they would disappear, nothing would happen, but at the same time they give some counter for this drawing, and I wanted the drawing to have the line art. That's why there is the line art, I am sure you get what I mean. The more important thing it is what I discovered recently, and that's nothing that is something changing the world. It's not going to put the artistic world upside down, but it is something cool. Especially when you try, when especially when you started with digital art, I think that knowledge can make it way easier. Yeah, so the shadows, of course, I... I decided to use again the power of the software. You can be the best artist in the world, things go much easier and much faster when you use the potential of things that you use. Ta da! <laughs> yeah, so here the amazing thing you have in digital art it is layers. But you don't need to use layers only for the, for the color. You can also use it for the shadows and light. And that's what I did. Uh, instead of putting the colors on the drawing, I started off rendering the shadows and the light. And to do that, I just used the layers and the mode of shadows. 
I mean for shadows, I use the mode of shadows uh, putting more and more layers of shadows, keeping the same color to give it some depth and about lighting, there I used luminosity I didn't want to make anything too much but here the power of these layers is that you can put the opacity bigger, smaller and you can adjust everything the way you like and why is it good? firstly, if you want to change the color you don't need to recolor all the drawing to start everything over you can just put the colors under the layer of shadows and everything is fine if you don't like the color of the shadows you can change it also with three clicks isn't it amazing? I think it's amazing. It's something that digital art allows us to do and that's how you can do that. That's what I did and it saved a lot of my time. I made this drawing in less than like less than a half of time that I usually take for a drawing because here I didn't need to be focused on oh maybe I should take this color mm, maybe that ah no here I just could make the shadows and then do some little cute things with the colors yeah but this time there will be nothing about the colors so moving on to another topic which is I think important nowadays so as you know or you don't if you don't now you do uh, I am alone I'm alone and during these hard times it is really hard I felt down really often, I felt really bad, I decided to go into my world, world of creating, to lost my mind, not think, just create. And I suppose there are other people who try to fight against the loneliness they are living right now. Maybe that's not the worst thing to do imagine living maybe you don't have to imagine it's even worse in an abusive family right now where most of the arguments were happening at home when you could go to school everything was all right or maybe you're over school maybe you're an adult maybe you're in a healthy relationship and you're stuck with your partner it's really hard to live this time is really hard but i don't know about neither of these things I know only about loneliness that I'm experiencing myself but to people who are like me you can do that I suppose we already lived harder things than being just lonely you can still find a way to be with people I see it is hard I live it myself however it seems like the world is going to end, but it's only up to us, I think. If I did, I did, but if you're alive, use it in any way you can. Try to do what you love, what you couldn't do before. Take it as an opportunity, as a chance to, to discover who you truly are. Maybe we all suffer from the same thing, which is we are not able to be alone with ourselves. And maybe we should work on ourselves. I don't say it's your case. I don't know you. I'm talking to many people. There can be really weird cases. I'm just saying, let's stay strong. I felt down. I didn't want to get up from my bed today because what's the point? I can't go anywhere. But I could come here to this mic. And talk and I'm glad I could do that yeah outside of that uh, it is worth mentioning because I mentioned about it in the previous video so I feel I need to do it right now my comic I start to release it recently and I, I even decided to stop I could do that but I feel much more fire inside me toward making the videos, start talking. I love talking to people, so here I am. That's really highly possible that I'll come back to that, but there's time for everything. 
so that's it for today's video i hope you enjoyed it i feel really nice after saying all that so big relief personally i also feel better i really wish you all the best i don't need to know your face i can see you only as a number i don't care i know there is a human behind the screen as i'm not only the animated media character but i'm also a human that smiles to you and catch some love from me have a wonderful day and bye bye Thank you.